Marnesba was a force to be reckoned with. She was all about breaking down barriers that would divide us as people. She was funny, she was feisty, and she was focused. Marnesba Tackett was the person who was instrumental in desegregating schools in Los Angeles. Her fight was to make it possible for you to go to any school that you want to. And she brought SCLC to the center of that discussion. She realized that education was the great equalizer. When she saw an injustice, she didn't stand for it. It didn't matter what color a person was. Everyone in her eyes was someone and had the potential to become great. You could call her high yellow, but she looked white. That didn't stop her from just saying, oh, you know, I can pass as white. I don't need to fight for my people because, you know, I can pass. And for her, equality and social justice was very important. Marnesba was influential with bringing Martin Luther King to Los Angeles the first time he ever came to speak. Birmingham, Alabama, or Los Angeles, California, the cry is always the same, we want to be free. She was very active in every aspect of civil rights in Los Angeles. She would have meetings and there would be 50, 60, 70 people there meeting and they would be strategizing, figuring out which way to go and how to do it. She was this feisty fighter, the master of strategy and tactic. She started Project Ahead, a program to equip parents with the skills to track the development of their children. She started Kedron, teaching the mothers how to write so they could help the kids with the homework. She always had a fight in her. Menezba transformed the racism in the insurance industry, the brutality in the police department, and the segregated practice of housing. Marnesby didn't take no for an answer. She would figure out how to beat the system. This woman was a trailblazer. A fighter. She fought for your right to be who you are. Marnesba was a small package, but she was full of dynamite.